was, whoa, 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 we're into a fish already. Was, oh, no way. No. There's one. There's one. Come on, baby. Just switch colours. Uh, what's going on, guys? So today's video, we're going back out on the rider kayak. I uh, wasn't really planning on doing this today, but I had a new trolling motor turn up yesterday. So I want to test it out. So come to a local bit of water. I fished this in a video uh, a little while ago. Um, it's not the best, but it's like five minutes from my house. So yeah, I just want to test the motor out. Hopefully catch some fish. There's always a chance of a big one. So yeah, fingers crossed for that. It is nice weather for it today, to be fair. So we should catch, hopefully anyway. So yeah, I'm going to get the kayak blown up, get the motor on, the batteries, the rods and everything in and uh yeah go for a session we'll do some trolling we'll do some casting and yeah catch some fish hopefully that's that's the main goal always so yeah catch you guys on the water uh right guys finally got everything loaded up I feel like it took forever today but we're ready for the new motor trying to keep it pretty streamlined i've got a spare batter on the front now so that's making pretty heavy but yeah, <laughs> should be all right, I think. Um, I just brought a spare battery because I'm planning on doing trolling. So I might end up burning the Rebel cell pretty quick. I'm not sure how this motor is going to be with battery or anything. So yeah, lab jackets on, let's get on the water. Got a launch where the swans like to sit, but, you know. I suppose it is their home after all. That's definitely faster than my other one. <laughs> definitely faster. That's way better. the kayak sitting really like front end heavy though because i've got a big battery at the front all right so while we're motoring to the first spot looks like we've got pretty clear water but a lot of weed though um just gone into with the motor <laughs> and yeah the water's flowing towards us so I'll probably end up doing trolling to start with just gone through loads of bait fish there to be fair um so yeah, actually I might put it on a slow speed to start, do a bit of casting and then we might troll, troll up and then um, yeah, drift back down. See how bad it is for weed and stuff first. So yeah, this motor, it's 54 pound thrust. My old one was 40 pound thrust, I think. So a little bit more powerful, a little bit faster. Um, so yeah, hopefully, hopefully it'll be better. I was sick of going really far and then it's taking ages to get back, etc. Or just not being able to troll fast against flow. So that's why I've gone for a bit more of a powerful motor. Running that on the old Rebel Cell 1250, which we'll see how it goes with this trolling. But on my old kayak, with my old motor, I used to last like uh, a full day. But yeah, I've brought this bed battery just in case it doesn't. But yeah, we'll see. I'm on, I'm on the plan on being out for maybe five or six hours. We're going to be doing a bit of trolling against the flow, which, you know, burns batteries. Whoa, 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 we're into a fish already. Not even started yet. Not even started yet. Didn't even get a hook set then. It's not a bad one either, to be fair. Yeah, this might pop off. I didn't even get it. Oh no, it's really smart, actually. I didn't even get a hook set then. Oh man, it's digging now, it's digging. <laughs> Come here, baby. Come here, baby. Okay, not even really started yet, and we've got a fish. Super. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Don't be getting hooks in my kayak. <laughs> yeah, this is a very, very active fish. Wow, I hope they're all like this today. There we go, unhooked. Oh my, it's stocky. Look at that, 
It's not long at all, but look how stocky that is. That's a little beauty. A little beauty to start things off that. Well happy. See you, buddy. Okay. <laughs> this is some talking crap. I don't even know what I was talking about, but there we go, first fish. I might not troll that, I might just keep doing what I've just been doing. I'm definitely gonna get my net set up now anyway. You can see, hopefully you can see anyway, how uh, fast we're drifting back now. That's sort of like perfect speed for drifting. So yeah, definitely save some motor battery if I just trolled up and drifted back. Well, the problem with trolling now is there's tons of floating weed. So I might get caught up quite a bit, but we'll see. We'll see. going pretty quick i'm only on speed three out of five so yeah i've got some decent speed on oh i just got whacked just got whacked first hit on the troll just moved out into the middle a little bit more so i was trolling quite in the edge where i want to fish on the way back and just got a... oh it's took it again oh it's tiny <laughs> Oh, it's gone. Ah, oh, that was going to be fish number two then. <laughs> oh man, proper whacked it on the troll then though. I thought it was going to be a better fish than that. Whew, okay, nearly fish number two. I'm going to have one more cast back where that one just came from. Just in case there's another one there. I don't bother standing up or anything for it. But... There we go, nearly had fish number two. Very small pike. Proper thumped it though. There's a fish. Oh, it's a small one again. <laughs> Hit it hard though. Come here, baby. Leader touch. Okay, second one landed. But it's, uh, yeah, that big. The pike I'm after probably could eat that fish, so see you baby, still happy to get it. Still a nice spot, but we would like to get a bigger one. But yeah, that's fish two, it didn't even pull the rig out. Fish number two into the kayak, and it's a small pike. But yeah, second hit on the trawl at least, so that's good. But I've been getting less hits than I expected, but it is nice to get some. Just came off the corner of this tree here. So where you'd expect them. All right guys, uh, didn't get on the GoPro, but just missed another fish. And it just followed the bait back as well. For some reason my GoPro wouldn't switch off. So yeah, we missed that one, but we had another hit on the trawl anyway. I just stopped to have a couple of cats back. Like I said, followed it back right to the kayak and uh, yeah, spooked off. So I doubt it'll come back, but Nice to see another fish. It was only small again. Oh. So, happy to get a hit. Right guys, stopped trawling now. Started drifting down, it got way too weedy. So I'm gonna switch to a jerk bait for a little bit. Feel like that is something that's gonna work a bit better today with how aggressive the hits that I've had so far have been. So, yeah, we'll see, we'll give this a go. Half an hour, if I don't get anything, I'll switch back to a soft bait but yeah you can jerk bait in I think this might be a ticket to getting a few more fish caught presents nice above this weed as well you can get a nice pause on it oh little pipe just hit it Baby, he's not even spooked away or anything. That was a really shy hit, that. that's annoying. Oh man. Maybe it was, just, it was a really small pipe, but yeah, so it, it, it bit it, but it wasn't very aggressive, so yeah, that's a little annoying. Another hit though. I said I've already trolled over this bit as well, so that's kind of cool. One eternity later. Oh, 
no. Oh, no. Just ripped it out of the water and one had followed it. No. That's the first freaking contact I've had in ages, that. No. Oh, man. At least I know they'll follow this bait then. Yeah, just to follow that. I didn't even see it. It looked like a decent swirl, but I'm <laughs> just about to cast and I heard it turn. Oh, man. That ain't coming back. Came off this side, that. Oh, that's frustrating. Had I just been watching a bit more carefully, I'd have seen him. Probably got him to bite, but... Oh, well. Right, guys, so camera's not been on for like the last hour or whatever and I've just lost a very nice pike easy double figure a lot I had one follow a little bit ago and then uh, switched this natural one again cast into this edge twitched it out of some weed and then smacked it easily a double figure pike it wasn't like a 20 or anything but yeah best fish I've seen all day my camera wasn't even on popped off just like at the side of the uh, kayak but yeah man, I'm kind of bummed about both things losing the fish and not even getting it on video as well so yeah that's really annoying i'll try to keep an eye on this make sure it stays on i don't even know why it switched itself off but yeah we just lost another fish yes. oh no way no way how did i miss that right in Brig in front of me. Nice looking fish as well. Look at that. God, <laughs> what a solid take. I'm so bad at fishing. Oh, <laughs> that guy, I don't know if that followed it or came from the side or what, but that hit it so good. Hopefully, you can see that on camera. It was literally in front of the boat. But... Oh, frustration or what? Long pause and then slam obviously didn't get hooked because it just uh turned the bait inside out like right? but god this is annoying me now i missed a lot of fish as again and that one hit it so hard like whew, flew out for it but yeah missed it because so i'm uh, not good at fishing And some bait scatter a bit further up um so there should be a pike around there at least all right i'm gonna rig another color up actually slightly slightly brighter than natural but still pretty natural pattern put some nice sharp hooks on it and uh yeah hopefully we can get some fish biting There's one, there's one. Come on, baby. Just switch colours. Come on, baby. Do not pop off. <laughs> oh. Not too bad size. Come on, baby. In. Look. Oh, man. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> Most awkward netting ever. But I've got him and he's on hooked. Whew. Okay, there's fish number three. Finally, right guys, finally got the third one in the net. Took bloody long enough, that's for sure. And missed quite a few hits, but it's a little, little chunky one again. I don't think it's the same one as that first fish, but there we go. Nice little short but fat pike. So, yeah, let's get this guy back. See you, buddy. Oh, finally oh, nice to be able to use my net today but still not a monster fish I'll take that after how hard it's been that's for sure missed my rig right up brand new rig it's alright at least we've had a fish Whew. Right guys, so my GoPro just died for a bit. Um, 
I didn't film loads of it, but I didn't catch any fish anyway, so it don't matter. Uh, ended up on this little other drain. Just wanted to try it out before I go. Uh, but yeah, that's probably going to do it for this video. Like I said, just going to test the motor. Working real good. And tons of weed at the minute. It's very shallow where I am, so yeah, not the best place to come down with it. But yeah, motor's good. Way better than my last one. I'll leave a link to the motor in the description if anyone wants to check out. Obviously, I'm not, say so again, I'm not affiliated with the company or anything. I, I bought it off eBay. Uh, shouldn't really have to say that, but everyone seems to think I'm promoting stuff if I don't. So, yeah. I bought the motor, uh, but yeah, that's going to do it for this video. Three fish landed, four missed. So yeah, not the best, but not the worst. Four hours of fishing, you know, could have been way worse than that. Um, that's the thought. The Rebel Cell, if you can see, has 68% battery left, and that's four hours of fishing trolled up a long way and then obviously using the motor to you know adjust and everything so yeah the battery's lasted fine no problems with that didn't really need to bring that big heavy lead one out with me but it's always good to have a backup just in case i ended up going a lot further than i did so yeah that's it hope you guys enjoyed